don't even know where the fuck I'm going. Hey, hi. With my actual name on it. <laughs> Yes, I have a romance. She's right here. Here. Yeah. I'm right here. Um, I literally. Hello. How are you doing? So, yeah, I'm starting this one off in my car in a service station in. Where am I? I'm in. Reading. I'm in Reading. I'm in a service station on the M4 near Reading. As you can tell from the title, I am going to the little lounge, lounge underwear Christmas sleepover party thing. It's two nights and it's in, oh, I don't even know where the fuck I'm going. It's somewhere, it's somewhere about two hours from wherever I am right now. Um, and the reason I've stopped is because I'm trying to make myself look slightly more presentable for when I get there. I had to leave the house really early this morning and I just wasn't in the mood to be doing my face. So I've had a quick makeup, coffee and sandwich stop and then we're gonna just head on over there. I asked you guys on Instagram whether or not I should vlog it and you said yes and I was like, right, I have to. So I think this will be really fun. I can just like bring you with me, show you around. I honestly don't know what's happening. I know we're having dinner tonight and I think that's kind of like our Christmas dinner. But we're there for two nights and basically three days. So I don't really know what else is going on. So hopefully it'll be really fun. Hopefully we'll do some really fun, cute Christmassy things don't really know what to expect to be honest um i know a couple of the girls who are going so that's really nice i'm just gonna put some mascara on and then go i think i'm about two hours away still um but yeah i'm excited kind of nervous but like normal like it's normal to be nervous when you're going to a place that you've never been before with a load of people you don't know don't know what you're going to be doing but it'll be fun it'll be exciting so yeah i'm gonna do my eyes I'm gonna drink my coffee and then we're gonna go to Ledbury. I had a Google of the place mm -hmm. online and it looks beautiful, like a whole bunch of barns that have obviously been converted and it just looks absolutely stunning. But yeah, I'll stop talking shit and we can get going. Right, I will see you when I get there. Yeah, I got here like two hours ago and that last bit of the drive was slightly horror movie-esque because it was getting really dark. Um, so that wasn't the funnest, but we're here. And before the girls come in, I'm gonna show you our, it's not even our room, it's like our whole entire barn, right? So we have our suitcases. Emily is here for two nights and she has brought that with her, which makes complete and total sense. So normal. We have a little welcome, the piggery, cute. Sofas and like, look, ridiculous ceilings. This obviously was like once actually a barn and they've renovated it. So yeah, we've just got here. That's why all our stuff is here. That kitchen, I'm gonna be taking photos, sat on that counter later and I will promise to anti back it when I'm done. Sparkly Christmas lights, which are so cute. And then to our rooms, hello. Um, come through here and we have a little bathroom which is very sweet cute 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 there is a pig there is me hi um and we go through here and there's two bedrooms so me and emily are in this one which is cute and then the twins are in this lovely one oh it's all so nice but look what i have like this is just so cute i feel so spoiled and i do not deserve all these goodies but i haven't opened these yet but i have something in there which maybe we could open now a card and a dressing gown with my actual name on it like that's ridiculous that's completely honestly insane sorry i've just clocked my hair because it's very windy and rainy and i will sort that out later should we see what's in the um should we see what's in the box? Okay, it's now an unboxing video. Okay. This is exciting. 
I am gonna like do my makeup and hair and get ready for dinner later. Oh, Christmas card. And then this. I've seen these on Instagram. Santa's fave. I actually love them. They actually say Santa's fave. That is unreal. And then the little matching bra as well. I literally can't wait to start taking pictures. Somewhere like this especially, I see like corners of rooms. So I'm like, oh, pictures. I can't wait to take pictures. So yeah, that was my unboxing video. <laughs> I am now going to get ready for dinner. I feel like the day has kind of gotten on top of me for a bit. I've done so much traveling today and that drive was actually quite long, especially with the stop. So I'm gonna get ready for dinner and then go and eat dinner. Cool. I don't know what to do with myself, honestly. It is the day after I last spoke to you. So we're on day two of our little trip here in this lovely, lovely countryside land. That I'm still not entirely sure where we are, but it's what it looks like. It's what it looks like. We've even got a fire on, which is cute. I think I am late for lunch. So I'm going to go and find everyone and have lunch. And then I think the plan for today is to basically just like get a bit of content. I know we're making cocktails and pizza. No, we're making cocktails, we're eating pizza this evening. And the rest of the day after lunch is kind of free. So I'm gonna shoot some content. Hello, that's me. <laughs> I'm gonna shoot some content all afternoon. We got given those beautiful underwear sets and we have this kitchen. And for me, this is like the ideal shooting setup. It's just white. I don't know if you ever noticed on Instagram, but the main thing that I do to all my photos is literally just white in the background. So this little space is a dream for me. Sorry, I'm just getting myself together. <laughs> but yeah, we're gonna go and have lunch now. Then I'm gonna shoot some content all day. I will show you how I do it because I use my tripod and I use my little self timer click. So, God, I'm having a stress here, aren't I? Let me just go. So I will make sure that I show you kind of how, I, how I'm gonna get my content later. And obviously this barn is just so perfect. Like it would be such a wasted opportunity not to use it to shoot. Also look, this is outside. Very cute, very cute. I think I showed you yesterday, but the light, it was dark when I got here. But isn't it so, just so cute? There are also grouses everywhere. And I thought they were, um, What's the thing that's like a grouse, but not a grouse? Pheasant. I thought they were a pheasant, but Emily shouted at me and told me they're a grouse. Anyway, I'm gonna go and have lunch. You're gonna come with me and have lunch. And then I will see you in a sec. So that was lunch. <laughs> that was actually really nice. Um, I've just come back to the main house to get some underwear because there's like an hour of light left. And I'm just gonna shoot as much content as I can, but because we're here, I can show you how cute this is. Like. This is kind of like the communal, oh, the tree lights aren't on, that's a shame. But we've got a cute fire, cute Christmassy stuff, sofa, dining table, really lovely kitchen, ceilings are just a dream. Like, isn't it just so, it's so sweet. This is the underwear that Mel, bless her, said that I could kind of shoot, shoot a few bits that I wanted. So I'm thinking, I actually brought that with me maybe that set is really nice and i don't know if you ever felt the lounge underwear but this is the softest fabric honestly you'll ever feel mm, what do we think that one oh it's gonna have to be this one i think that like deep red okay let's nab that Just gonna, i feel like i'm stealing honestly 
And then maybe, should we just nab that too? I reckon let's go with those. Cute, right? Let's just do this set. Hello. Hey. I feel like I'm stealing from you. <laughs> <laughs> like in the river, now I'm here <laughs> taking it away. <laughs> do, do, do. So I'm back now, and as you can see, it's still really light, so I'm going to crack out as much content with my tripod friend as I possibly can. I think I could do a shot like here, like down the corridor kind of thing. Obviously, if it is successful, I will insert the shots here. And then I've got the beautiful kitchen, like I mentioned, I'm sure I can do some more in there. And I just got these two beautiful red sets of lounge underwear that are just so festive and cute so i think i'm gonna put a little bit more makeup on um and then just crack on crack on with shooting <laughs> more chill now i'm just having a chill 10 minutes like these trips are really cool and they're really fun and like they're amazing and it's so fucking cool that i got invited um but that doesn't mean that they're not a lot because they are a lot and they can be really like draining like understandably so like it's a lot there is like a lot of social things going on so basically a long-winded way of saying i'm just having five minutes in my room with a coffee and my laptop because i've actually um i'm now behind on emails <laughs> so i'm just chilling the girls are next door taking some photos and you saw i did get to take some and they were really good and i'm really happy with them i know it seems a bit weird to like have a relax by doing your emails but i personally genuinely really do find it relaxing i find it relaxing to get it done but yeah i'm having i'm basically i'm just having 10 minutes to myself um, I've got my comfies on <laughs> and um, I know I mentioned but we're doing cocktail making and pizza eating tonight and then I think we're watching a Christmas film which I'm really excited about so I'm just gonna chill out before then uh, and yeah I just thought I would come and say hi anyway I'm gonna get on with these emails and I'll see you in a bit <laughs>
that was that. I'm going home now. Yeah, I'm in the car on the way back. I actually just stopped because I wanted to put a podcast on. And obviously I can't do it when I'm driving. Um, so I thought I'd obviously also say hi as well and let you know what's going on. Yeah, that was like overall. Why is it beeping like that? There's nothing behind me. There's literally nothing behind me. Okay, I'm gonna have to check what the fuck's going on. BRB. Anyway, I'm currently in two two. Tewksbury Borough. Thanks. Um, not sure where where exactly that is, but uh, that's where I am. And yeah, I'm just about to drive. Well, I am driving home. I've been driving for about 20 minutes, but I wanted the podcast. Last night, I think you saw we did a bit of like cocktail making and eating pizza, which was fun. Everyone was on good form. I had a drink, which is literally unheard of for me. It made my mouth go numb. Um, so I went back to the room. <laughs> I'm gonna stop and get some lunch in about an hour. As like an entire like press tri trip, press trip experience. It was very full on because it was two nights, two and a half days, three days kind of, which is a lot of like, for me, not all the time, but a lot of the time I'm in like work mode because I'm there with people that I work with. And obviously I'm friends with some of the girls and stuff and genuinely like the girls from lounge I would say I'm like they're genuine friends they're so lovely but you're still always on that funny like work thing you know it's like obviously I work full-time too and it's like when we go out for like our work Christmas drinks you're just very aware that like you're with your boss <laughs> like your boss is there we're trying to have fun and be merry and Christmassy, but also, you told me off last week for missing my deadline. That's not an actual example, but you know, it's that weird like work, not work boundary. So when you're there for three whole days and two whole nights, it's a bit like, okay, you just need some space. Just need some space to be by myself. I'm so chill with being in my own company. I am so chill. So having that much full on time with so many people, it's tiring for anyone like it is tiring for anyone but no it was really good i've said it a thousand times now but they were all so lovely they took care of us so nicely i have so many lounge goodies they gave us so much beautiful stuff i've got so many pictures again if you follow me on instagram and you haven't already seen at least six just give it a few days because there will be so much lounge coming out but yeah i'm heading home my sat nav says i have 159 miles to go um and that's gonna take me three hours. But maybe we can stop and have a quick catch up when I get a coffee and some lunch at the services. I'll speak to you a little bit later. Ugh, oh, so cold. I am at the world's most depressing service station. I know most service stations are pretty depressing. Unless you're at one of the, you know, like, top tier service stations and i'm talking cobham that's about it really like just sad you walk in and there's just like sadness in the air i'm gonna eat this and then drive back i should probably say bye here actually because because i've done the trip now and um yeah that was what the vlog was so um goodbye from a depressing car park somewhere in Reading. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope it was a bit interesting. It was a lot interesting for me. I'm glad I vlogged it because it's just fun. I will see you very soon with another video which will be a haul of some sort. I've not decided if it's PLT or House of CV yet but one of the two. But I, uh, I love you lots and I will see you soon. Bye. Is that on? I don't know how to be with you Cause these other niggas have been right by your side Till 2005 That is stuck in my hair Ow Oh my god, I'm in the glass! Thank you so so much I really appreciate that
I literally can't. <laughs> I'll be here. We could do that one more time. Hi. Let's do <laughs> just, just, I am here. I'm right here. 